Good day, how are you? This is Jose Tamayo for the Blind Tech Channel. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about Microsoft Outlook and we are working with Outlook 2016. For those of you who have been asking about this, here we go. And we are talking about dealing with signatures in Microsoft Outlook 2016. Really quickly, I'm going to show you the commands to get into the signatures and then go through the interface. So I'm going to move right into it, right guys? All right, let's go. I am in Microsoft Outlook right now and I'm going to press Alt F for file. Alt F backstage view file list box. And then I'm going to press the up arrow and I'm going to hear exit 10 of 10. Exit 10 of 10 and I'm going to press up arrow again. Options 9 of 10. And I'm going to press enter on options here. Enter list box attachment. So we are in the options. Mail. Now what you want to do is you want to press down arrow, which is what I just did, and go into mail. You're going to have a bunch of options here, but what you want to get into is you want to get into mail, and then you want to tab into... Tab, mail, come tab, compose messages, tab, always check, sp tab, spelling and autocorrect, dot, tab, ignore original, tab, signatures, dot, 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 button to activate, press space bar, alt plus n. Signatures, and I'm going to activate this with space bar. Space, Outlook Options Dialog, Signatures and Stationary Dialog, Email Signature Page, Choose Default Signature, OK button to activate, press space bar. All right, so let's go through this dialog here really quickly, and this is all I'm going to do today, but I wanted to show you that there is a way to uh, work with signatures, and it's not really that complicated, but it's just a matter of finding the command. Tab, cancel, but tab, to switch pages, press tab, select signature to edit, list box, select signature to edit, to move to an item, press the arrow keys. Tab, select signature to edit, new button, to activate, press space bar, all then. So you want to do a new signature if you want to? Tab, email account, colon, combo box, closet, hotmail .com, to change the selection, use the... So if you want to do it for specific emails, if you have multiple emails configured in your Microsoft Outlook account, you can choose your email from there. For example, open list box. In this case, I have organization to mail at gmail.com. KK Forge. Organization plaza at hotmail.com. Organization to mail at gmail.com. KK Forge AZX at gmail.com. In my case, I have three email accounts defined in Microsoft Outlook, and what happens is when you get an email, uh, when you set it by email account, you'll be able to get a signature individualized per email account. Email signature tab, tab. select signature to edit list box email signature to move to an item, press the arrow keys. So here, email signature. Tab, select signature to edit, new button to activate, press space bar, all then. So I just tabbed around to show you a little bit about the dialogue and I'm going to hit new here. Space, signatures and stationary dialogue, email signature page, new signature dialogue, type a name for the signature, colon edit to activate, press space bar, alt. So you've created a signature, let's call this, let's see, let's call this default signature. D-E-F-A, A-F-E-D, space, caps lock off, D-E-F-A-U-L-T, space, D-D-S-I-G-A-T-U-R-E. Signature default signature. I've called it default signature. I'm gonna press tab. Tab OK button to activate press space bar. Tab cancel button. Tab type a name for the signature. Tab OK button. So you see guys, you have that option. I'm gonna press OK here. Enter Outlook Options Dialog. Signatures and stationary dialog. Email signature page. Select signature to edit. New button to active. So I'm going to press Shift Tab here. Shift Tab. Delete button to active. Shift Tab. Select signature to edit list box. Default signature to move to an item, press the arrow keys. Alt. So I press shift tab to select the signature that I've created. Right now I only have one, right? I'm going to call it default signature. This is what I'm going to use for everything that goes up. And then later on I'm going to define stuff that's going to go for each email account. If you want to do that, you could do that. All right, so we're going to look at the signature that we want to edit here, right? And we already have tab, default, shift tab, tab, default signature. All right, we have default signature, but instead of tabbing all over the place here, we're going to hit uh, shift tab to get back to the edit field, right? Shift tab, shift tab, cancel, but shift tab, okay, but shift tab, signatures and stationary, edit signature, type in text. There it is, edit signature. I'm going to type in my 
signature here. J O O J caps lock off. Turn on, turn off caps lock here. J O S E S T A A O enter. My name is Jose Tomeo Bland. And here's my email address. E colon space J E B L S at A O M S E M I A I L. Curious O enter. Link E colon colon space J T B L A S at H O T M A I L. Period C O M Bland. All right. Link E colon hotmail dot com Bland. I'm going to throw in my email address here and I'm going to throw in my hashtag here. Number. V I I O N one zero zero enter number vision one hundred link e colon closet hotmail dot com Jose Tomeo and then later on I'm going to throw in my phone number at the end here all right link e number vision one hundred blank then I'm going to hit tab here tab to activate press space bar tab cancel shift tab okay but enter outlook options outlook options mail compose messages signatures dot 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 enter all right I'm going to go back into signature here. To activate and verify that I have JTBLAS selected here. Tab, cancel, but tab to switch pay tab, select signature tab, delete shift tab, select signature to edit list box, default signature. To All right, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna select that one to edit anymore. I'm just gonna hit tab, tab here. Tab, select tab, select signature to edit tab, email account colon combo box, closet hotmail.com to change the selection use the arrow key. So come back over here and select your email account and then select the various options for it. Tab, new messages colon combo box, default signature to change. Okay, you're gonna use the default signature for new messages and tab. Reply slash forwards colon combo box left parent and right parent. And let's select it for replies as well. Default signature. I just pressed the down arrow. Default signature. Tab. Default signature. Font combo box. Calibri left parent body right parent. I'm going to skip all of this, right? I'm going to hit shift tab here. Shift tab. Shift tab. Noom shift tab. Email shift tab. Select shift tab. Select the shift tab. Delete button shift tab. Shift shift tab. To active shift tab. OK button to all activate right. press space bar. I just hit shift tab because there are a bunch of options that we don't need and the signature has already been edited. I'm going to press OK here. Enter Outlook options. Outlook on Shift tab. Ignore original Shift tab. Spelling and Shift tab. Always sh Shift tab. Compose mess Shift tab. Editor options dot 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 Shift tab. Categories Shift tab. Cancel but Shift tab. OK button to All right, remember, instead of going through all the options in the dialog, to hit tab, to hit OK here, just go back, Shift tab. You're going to get to the OK button really quickly instead of having to go through hundreds of options here. Enter inbox dash closet hotmail dot com dash outlook. So right now I'm going to show you how I got this signature. Now I'm just going to hit control N for a new email and then I'm just going to hit right into the body. Control N untitled dash message left. All right and I'm going to hit alt grave sign here. Message edit. And then I'm going to read the signature. Land Jose Tomeo e colon link closet hotmail dot com number vision 100 land. There's the signature right there. Also, button inbox I'm going to reply Enter. to an email. Land. Submit search button to activate press escape list box. Might enter. Let's open up an message. email here and I'm going to reply. Alt R. Message. Edit. Now notice. Land. Jose Tomeo. I'm pressing the down arrow here. Colonsplazatotmail.com. Number vision 100. Land. All right, guys, that's how you do signatures here. And if you have any questions, any further questions, please feel free to post them down below or send us an email at blindtechchannel at gmail.com. Blindtechchannel is B-L-I-N-D-T-E-C-H. And then channel, C-H-A-N-N-E-L, at gmail.com. Take care, guys.